Today is a very special video dedicated to a very special young lady. She's a Detroit Lions fan, which warms my heart. A lot, mine too. Oh, that was important. She's a huge fan of the show. Wow, can't believe it. Which warms my, well, bank account, because she's a Patreon. <laughs> yeah, so she's a Patreon member, and she won the monthly giveaway, and she said, guys, instead of giving me money, I want to see you two jamokes do some fish. That's the Jesus of fans, just completely giving and no yeah, receiving. Gotta she is. love it. She's the Jesus of number six with cheese. You have done very well, my child. So today we're headed to Fish Bar, the heart of Lakeview, the same owner as DMK Burger, no which kidding. we've been to. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. So today, Sean and Corey, Corey and Sean, Corey and Sean. You nailed it. Cod fillets. Is that the good one? God, I hope so. <laughs> So nice in there. Yeah, man. Wow. They were just they were they were they were nice, all right. Shout out to Kaylee. Kaylee was which I don't know personally, but she was just a gem. It seemed like you guys were old friends. We right? Sean. Like, Sean, what up? Like I go in there all the time. You guys had like a secret. Yeah, I was like, I was like up? shucking, uh. shucking oysters in there earlier. East Coast and West Coast, you want you want a dozen? Two of the cod sandwiches from Fish Bar, which we've never had. Never in my life. Acquired on number six with cheese, Chicago's best comedy food show. <laughs> God. Dude, we're both in black today. We're, we mean business. Yeah. Oh, I was scared that was the Sammy. Kettle crunch potato chips, sea salt and vinegar. What's Ew. vinegar? What's vinegar? I don't like the sea salt and vinegar. You're not a big fan of that? But that'll just save more room for the delicious cod Sammy we're about to slam. Here you go. TBD on whether it's delicious or not, but I got high hopes. Nice branding on your fish bar bags. These were $22.10 for both these pickup codfish. Two at $10. Plus in Chicago, the tax is $2.10. Corey adds up to $22.10. Sounds right. Mm -hmm. Excited to do this for Miss uh, Juliet Hagel. Thanks for forcing us to yeah. expand our uh, horizons into the fish realm. We don't we don't voyeuristically go into there very I often. eat a lot of fish without you. <laughs> Why? Second angle. <laughs> All right, what are we looking at? We're looking at what appears to possibly be a wheat bun, which I like. Um, I'm just basing it off of darker coloration. We look like we got some fried up cod, melted American cheese, lettuce, probably some sort of tartar sauce, and uh, removable tomatoes. Those look like such good tomato. Can I have your tomatoes? You can have all of the tomatoes. All right, don't get rid of those. Toss what do you think? What do you give it on presentation? I'm gonna say the presentation's, I like the cheese being melted. That it part's like good. It's like a burger. It's like melty and big. Yeah, I think it is kind of melty and big. I like it. I think it's I think A plus. Or no, cool. B plus. Room for growth. Watch this, right when that dog pees, I'm gonna yell. Don't do it. Why do you got the windows all the way up? Do a little bit of, don't, ah! don't yell. Don't, why you gotta do that? All right, so this uh, this spot, by the way, is right at Sheffield and uh, Wellington. You don't need to do the Easy to get to, easy to get to. You can roll the window down for you a little bit. Yours is looking amazing. Really? Dude, that melted cheese, bro. Yeah. You cheese, that cheese hang you got right there. Does your cheese hang low, dude? Does it wobble to and fro? Can you tie it in a knot? Can you tie it in a bu owl? Well, what do you think mud. of this guy wearing this like cranberry, bright cranberry shirt with jeans? I respect that. Yeah? He's pushing the norm. I like that. Taking chances. That's what you should do in life. Keep it up, brother. This is the codfish sandwich from Fish Bar here in Lakeview, Chicago. Juliet, this baby's for you. Woo! Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> the last time we had cod together, I think we put it against the uh, Alaskan Pollock. We've already showed it to you, but here's how this looks. Mm. Hmm. I straight up don't like this. Yeah, this is way fishier. Straight up, I don't even like this. I don't even... For McDonald's, because it was on a Wendy's sandwich. Yeah, for fish, this is pretty good. I'm not a big fish guy. Mm -hmm. So if I think it's pretty good, then uh, that means it's probably to fish people really good. What do you think? I think it's great. I would love to eat this. Is this healthy? Well, I'll it's tell you fried, that. It's it's got cheese. It's not healthy, but it's better than eating a burger. It's better than a burger? Fish will always be better than beef. That's true. At least like a fatty beef sandwich you'll get from a restaurant. I just hope that we're fulfilling all the fish voids that 
Juliet had had from us. Juliet, that amazing Patreon supporter. Yeah, so it stays together really well. It's got like a good little crunchy crisp to it because of that breaded fish being dropped in the deep fryer. It's breaded so well. It's breaded really, really well. Oh, this is good. For those of you who don't know, where we were just dropping the word Patreon a ton like a bunch yeah. of psychos. People are like, what does that mean? There's this awesome website that you can support creators that you like by signing up and donating like as little as a buck a month, five bucks a month, 10 bucks a month, 20 bucks a month. And if you do so much, you get little added bonuses like, yeah. uh -huh. well, sometimes we'll drop videos early for people if they donate what is it five bucks a month or something like that when I can get ahead on edits sometimes we'll do that yeah. it's a way that's how we are able to afford this food a lot of people are so selfless though like they'll just donate to the series because they know that we're trying to build this right right and honestly we've been using patreon for a year and a half and it's pretty much like saved our ass it's like yeah. it's allowed us to keep doing this and can't put out videos five days a week without the support of those guys no and there's no reason to unless you're growing and like the patreon crew is basically like a salary for us so if you've been watching our videos for a while and you've never donated and you have that little bit of extra income to do that like take care of yourself always but that little bit to help us like it really Even does a buck. Go, yeah seriously if you like the we're putting out 20 videos a month pop in for a couple months like for a dollar spend three dollars over the course of three months or whatever it's awesome right mm -hmm. so Juliet you are the star of today gosh this is good did I just hear you say gosh this is good this is good nice job fish bar so I was gonna say she won our giveaway for people who don't understand why we're she's sponsoring this mm -hmm. every month we give away $75 worth of gift cards to people who support us mm-hmm and some of those people, it's been a trend lately that they'll donate that money back to us for these meals. The most selfless people do. Mm -hmm. We have the best cult following show. Mm -hmm. it's the, our fans are so great. I love them. Let's talk. Let's all chat down in the comments, you know? Let's have a conversation. She said, think of it more as a conversation. How that uh, sauce on it is so good. Man, that last bite was really good. It's really salty and good. And also, yeah, we really called good. them. It was ready in like seven minutes, and they brought it to us fresh, piping hot. That was a perfect yeah. exchange. And I was Fish being bar crushed it. For some reason, I was acting like a goober when Sean said they were super nice in there. They were unbelievably nice. Yeah, they were seriously so cool and so nice. That was an all-around super, super awesome experience. Yeah. Wow, it really was. I never thought in my life I'd be all about a fish spot. Fish ain't usually my thing, but fish bar is. It is today. After this video, we're gonna open two packages for a, a fun little fan submitted mail thing. Yeah, so stick around after we rate this thing. Now off to your commercial break. Today's episode of Number Six, six with Cheese is brought to you by the Cash App. Yeah. <laughs> Out of five, Nemo's from Finding Nemo. So I don't think cute. he was a cod. He was like a clownfish, right? How many Nemo's do you give the codfish sandwich from Fish Bar? Yeah, sorry, it brightened up, guys. It was over. So you're comparing this to other fish sandwiches, which for you is tough because the only fish sandwiches you've really ever had are fast food fish sandwiches. Yeah, right? I really don't have the. A gourmet one to compare it to. Yeah, my taste buds don't have those experiences. You haven't traveled to Maryland and it had a bunch of fresh fish just off the coast. Oh, I got a big one! That's not Sean, you. Sean, the amount of times that I have to remind you of the crazy privileged <laughs> life you've had. Richie Rich over here. I actually am Macaulay like, Culkin. We know who you are. What? No chopper? <laughs> <laughs> my dad hardly ever lets me take the helicopter to school. Oh, no chopper to go to school. <laughs> there, I like how this is becoming an actual theme of the show that people think I grew up like with good money. Oh, that guy got home, mm -hmm. snagged his super hot girlfriend, and now he's gonna go take her for a night on the town. You know, they're going out to fish bar. They're yeah, gonna go dude, they're gonna have a nice have a meal great... at fish bar. Yeah, hey, you guys enjoy yourselves. Have the cod. I mean, that was in my world, in my experiences, that was a five. That was really, 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 really good. Whoa. I mean, what am I going to say? You know? That's true. You're comparing it against, you're not leaving any room for a cod sandwich to get better? In my experiences, that's as good <laughs> as it could possibly All be. All right, man. That's cool. I'm going to give that codfish sandwich a 3.5. In my privileged life, I've been to like the Privilege. East Coast. Can you go to a tutor? <laughs> How to talk? <laughs> yeah, a little um, I've been to like the East Coast a lot, and I love like fresh fish out of the ocean. Fry it up, pan fried, baby. Little, little oh, panko bread, bread little panko breading on there. Have you even shot one of these things before? A whole 17 years we've known each other. I've been sneaking off to go on little hunting trips around the world. No, I don't even know what the fuck a quail is. You're just out there just reeling out into the That's ocean. That's pretty good, but I, uh, yeah. 3.5. That's incredible. I didn't know it gets that even better. Oh, it gets it gets great when you're this. The women don't oh, look at you? You just said this, and then they can't see, but a bunch of... Your tongue just started moving aggressively. <laughs> like a bunch of weird wet noises. Ugh. Jesus. I thought we were about to die. Yeah. Oh. I like when people say ow and you definitely didn't get hurt. <laughs> We've got the goods. 
excellent. You go first today. Let's see how you open these. Do these have like a thing that you can do? Don't, you're gonna hurt your teeth. No. You don't need another trip back to Oralville. And then just maybe like a rip. Whoa, Whoa. that actually worked way better than I expected. And it's a necklace. A necklace? It's a necklace. It's got two leather ropes mm -hmm. and a little weird chain here. And a, oh, dude. Well, let me take the tag off. Sick, bro. Sick. There you go. Wow. There you go, man. bro. Dude. Dude, yeah, you're wearing that to every comedy wow, show. Wow, that's so sick. I think it's so much my style that it's like beyond my style. Like, I don't think Are I can. Are you trying even, to get a little like a choker? Are you trying I to put feel it on like a little, little, uh, little tighter? Once you get it on, it's hard to get off. Oh, that's you're what, trying to take it off. Huh? Yeah, it makes you a little nervous. That, you look pretty cool in that, though. Here, move your chin. Man, pretty sweet, guys. All right, this is uh, from Megan Ford. Ooh, we love Megan Ford. I also. Got a couple of souses. Ooh, handwritten note. No note in here. Sean and Corey, here are the packages I said I would send like a month ago. <laughs> I included some more of the Chattanooga whiskey that you liked. Thank you. Oh, that stuff was so good. The that stuff, stuff that I was crushed. So good. The barbecue sauces are from Sticky Fingers, a local barbecue Ooh, restaurant. That's good. Try them all on a mukbang Monday. The redneck lipstick barbecue sauce just looked interesting. The Lynchburg hot sauce was made in the home of Jack Daniels, so it has to be good. I love what you guys are doing. Keep up the good work. Megan Ford. Have you not heard of Jack Daniels before? I call it Jack and Dangles. You're not familiar with that brand? Jack and Dangles. What do we got there? Historic Lynchburg's Jalapeno Hot Sauce. Woo! Every time people walk by, he yells now. And this one, a cask Ooh, one now. What? Oh. Bro, are you stoked about trying that? Yeah, dude, I'm taking it home tonight. I'm gonna drink the whole thing. Bro, please don't. Come on, please. please. Can bro. I have some of it? Please don't drink the whole thing. Megan Ford, thank you so much. Who is that lady just walking in the middle of the street to, bro? It's been in the street for too long. Get on the sidewalk. Sixers, Never. thank you so much for the stuff. We love it. We love that you're you're the patrons that are donating to yeah. us. We love all you guys. Juliet, hope you like this video. Uh, thanks yeah. for turning us on to cod fillets from Fish Bar, even though, you know, we wouldn't have I probably had it. that. I loved it. Quit, get, get your skin off of me. What's that thing you were doing? Oh, bro, you gotta go like this. Oh, the, the cool way? Yeah. <laughs>